Watercar Panther. Produced by California-based company Watercar, the Watercar Panther is an innovative combination of SUV and boat. It has received some measure of acclaim on account of its ability to conquer both landlocked and aquatic terrain, as well as the uncanny ease with which it transforms from a road-going SUV to a seafaring boat. In addition to this remarkable feat, the Panther also lives up to its namesake in terms of speed. Powering along at a respectable 80 plus miles an hour on the road and 44 miles an hour on the water. The Panther also has a six slotted grille, a folding windshield, half doors, roll bar, as well as a fiberglass V type hull, which ensures that the rider can drive along at high speeds on the water. You can purchase the Panther in all its power for the price of 158,000 US dollars. Gibbs Bisky. Forget reinventing the wheel, the Bisky will help you reinvent your entire two wheeled experience. It is a 55 horsepower twin cylinder engine scooter that runs on land like a normal moped. But get this it can transform into a water scooter at the touch of a button. Created by Gibbs Amphibians, a company known for their outside-the-box thinking as well as their reliability, this vehicle can run at speeds of up to 80 miles per hour on land and 37 miles per hour on water with its 55 horsepower twin-cylinder engine. To switch from land to water use, just flip a button, wait for the rear wheel to get fully retracted, and you are ready to cruise. Sherp ATV the Sherb ATV is one of the most sought-after all-terrain vehicles on the market. Renowned for its ability to conquer all manner of terrain, the Sherp battles rocky land with the same ease as it tears through fallen trees. Obstacles have been demonstrated to be insufficient to stop this vehicle on its rampage, with video showcasing the Sherp overcoming heights as tall as 70 centimeters high. Thanks to its 800-liter capacity tires, the Sherp can float in deep waters, travel at a respectable speed of 28 miles per hour on land and 3.7 miles per hour in water, while steadily plowing through anything man and nature can fling in its way. You can have yourself a Sherp ATV at prices starting from $65,000. ATV Shaman 8x8 Another impressive amphibious ATV also from Russia is the Avturos Shaman 8x8 and it is very big. The overall dimension measures at 20.7 feet long, 8.2 feet wide and 8.9 feet high. As the name suggests, the vehicle has 8 wheels. Ground clearance is about 18 inches and turning radius is a little shorter than 25 feet. All front and rear wheels can turn in opposite directions, which means the vehicle can almost drive around itself. Power is generated from an Iveco F1C 3.0 liter diesel engine that delivers up to 170 horsepower. With a curb weight of 4,800 kilograms and maximum payload of nearly one and a half ton, top speed is 44 miles per hour on land or 4.3 on water, with the optional propeller attached. Fuel consumption is 9.4 miles per gallon. Gibbs Quadski The Gibbs Quadski looks like a ferocious blend of the best characteristics of an all-terrain vehicle and a jet ski. One of its most impressive features is its ability to transform from one to another simply at the switch of a button. This device is powered by a BMW Motorrad K1300 engine which gives it the ability to rocket at speeds of up to 45 miles per hour both on land and on water. Carefully constructed from lightweight materials, the Quadski has a composite hull, wide track and low center of gravity, which go a long way to ensure stability.
The quad ski has a range of over 600 kilometers on land and can travel for up to two hours over water. It is available for sale in some regions of the U.S. at prices starting from 40,000 U.S. dollars. Amphibibus This cleverly named vehicle does exactly what it says on the box. It is an amphibious bus. Created in Holland by the geniuses at Dutch Amphibious Transport Vehicles, the Amphibibus was designed to be the one-stop solution for all tourist transportation needs. Specifically designed to withstand the choppy conditions present at harbors all over the world, the Amphibibus made its trial run at the infamous Rotterdam Harbor, where it acquitted itself admirably. It is a 12.8-meter monster that can carry up to 50 passengers, and it is based on a modified Volvo bus chassis with a hull fixed in to allow for flotation on water. Fully certified by the European Transport Regulatory Authorities, it is alternatively driven by a Euro 5 engine and twin water jets, which push it to speeds of up to 8 knots in the water and a maximum road speed of 60 miles per hour. UHAC the UHAC, short for Ultra Heavy Lift Amphibious Connector, is a new transport vehicle developed by the U.S. Marine Corps for ferrying along troops, tanks, and trucks from ships to shore and back. This heavyweight transporter can also chug along at a decent clip, speeding along at speeds of up to 23 miles an hour, even while carrying loads of up to 200 tons. It was the product of years of research and development at Navitech, with financial support provided by the Office of Naval Research. It was designed to be able to drive both on the shore and over the top of obstructions up to 3 meters high. This stunning feat is as a result of tank-like treads that are fitted with captured air foam cells that ensure buoyancy when it's in water and serves as paddles, but also helps the UHAC drive on various terrain and through land. Geo Rescue Created by Romanian company Geo Motors, the Rescue is an amphibious vehicle that seems to be inspired by zombie apocalypse scenario on movies. Measuring at 17 feet long, the four-wheeled behemoth has enough space to take 11 passengers from point A to B through the most punishing terrain. All four wheels can be fitted with pneumatic pillows to make the 6,400 pounds vehicle stay afloat. It is also possible to install tank-style tracks on the rear wheels when the road is buried deep enough under snow. It can also hold nearly 200 gallons of water along with an assortment of hoses and pumps, so you can use it as a fire truck in times of emergency. Burlak ATV 6x6 This oddly named vehicle was specially designed to handle the typically rough Russian terrain and features an amphibious capability together with a 6x6 drive to plow through ice, sand, river, and swamp. The Burlak is able to carry 9 people in addition to 2 tons of load and it will still move at a top speed of 50 miles per hour on solid ground. When on water, the amphibious truck can go at just under 4 miles per hour using a propeller. Its body is made of aluminum to keep down the weight and it is powered by a 150 horsepower Cummins 2.8 ISF engine. In addition to this, it is heavily insulated to keep passengers warm and cozy and has a sturdy rear propeller that can be used to push through bodies of water and sheets of ice. Iguana Commuter Following the theme of animal-inspired vehicles, the Iguana Commuter is an innovative reimagining of the traditional amphibious vehicle. This exciting vehicle makes use of retractable caterpillar-like tracks to plot along over a variety of terrain at 5 miles per hour, while powering through water at speeds of up to 46 miles an hour. This vehicle is spacious enough to serve as a means of transportation while still being luxurious enough to serve as a home away from home while avoiding marinas and berths. It 
It is powered by a 40 horsepower onshore engine, and on land the boat is steered with the use of a handy joystick. If this all sounds attractive to you, then you can purchase the full package, which comes with carbon hull, outboard engine, and inboard engine, at prices starting from 659,000 US dollars.